I'll just, while well, we have a spare second, uh, this is the auto guide um, object, so gadget. Um, and it's something that is difficult to demonstrate, but the, the, the settings on here, so let's add it to our version. Um, so you find it in gameplay gear, auto guide, and you just stick it anywhere. Um, then you can tweak it, and it kind of looks like it's it's bugged out the bottom, but it's not. It just doesn't have a power button. Um, okay, so normally you can move it around however you like, and oh, just bring it out of there and uh, rotate it and whatever. Uh, if you have um, obey auto guides on, then uh, it will obey auto guides. So um, you can say keep up right and now when I try to rotate it, it only rotates around that axis, doesn't let me rotate in other ways. Um, and um, this is a uh, surface snap, so if you grab it, then the grab point, which for the puppet is the feet, grab point uh, will snap to stuff. And you can set it to with the labels to only snap to certain label objects. Um, or you can set it to snap orientation. So if I grab that, this is on normal surface snap. And it will stay upright still, even though we haven't got that on. We can rotate it like that, that would be fine. Um, but it puts that grab point um, on the object like that, um, on the object surface. If you go snap orientation, then it uses the orientation of whatever object it's on. Um, and you have grid snap, so let's turn that off. Um, and while you're moving stuff that doesn't have this obey auto guide thing, then if you don't have the grid on, it doesn't have the grid. But then if you have auto obey auto guides on, and you have an auto guide that says that it has grid snap, then it will be on the grid anyway. So that's really cool. I haven't actually used used it much myself because I haven't done that style of platformer. Oop, platformer. Um, but it, it's really nice if you have like cube blocks making up the level, but then you have like nice little um, other details like um, effects and like grass or whatever in different places that you don't need to grid snap. So you don't have to keep on turning it on and off, you can just add a auto guide to that object. And then this is the grid size that it uses when it's uh snapped so like that um it also has a scaling limit so turn that off um i can't scale it up or down um with uh the d-pad but if i have a smaller minimum scale then i can scale it down to that minimum scale and up to the maximum scale um <clears throat> of our seven. So um, if I set these back to their defaults, there's one and one. This is not the default size at the minute. When I grab it, it'll um, try and obey the auto guides and set it to that scale again. Um, that's the basics of the auto guides. The thing is with the snap and stuff is it requires a grab point. Um, a grab point is defined. You may not be able to see it here. Um, it's defined in the creation itself, as opposed to in the scene. Yeah. So uh, if it's an element, such as a character, then you can go. Um, show hide grab points. This is the point that will be at the end of the imp when you import it 
into a level. So if we put that at the head, and I import it into somewhere, Uh, right, so then if I make a scene and then bring in that element we made, now it's at the 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 head is at the tip of the imp. Um, I'll just go edit it. Uh, now. Turn that on again, it's still up there. If you um, press triangle on it, then it will default to like the center of the whatever stuff is in the scene. I don't know why that's off center, but then you can just drag it to wherever you want again. So um, if I put that like on the chest, base of the neck, like that, and try importing it again. Um, okay, so now the tip of the imp is on the top of the chest. Now I've replaced that. So by default, I think this has an auto guide, yeah, and it's got a uh, surface snap. So now if I turn on obey auto guide and grab it, it's grabbing it by that grab point. And if I put it on things, then it, it that grab point is what gets snapped to the surface. Uh, so that's how that works.